Hi guys, welcome to a Chomfy MX2 TV box review. It's a slightly designed box and looks quite impressive. It does not have the most exciting specifications, but the price is much lower than MX4, which is about $40. This box comes with 1GB DDR3 RAM and 8GB eMMC ROM running Android KitKat 4.4 with H3 or Winner chipset. And like MX4, it supports 4K and H265 video decoding as well, which is such a bargain when you think about the low price. Then let's take a look at what's inside the box. First we'll see the remote and plug. In the remote, we see the power button, the shortcut buttons for media, music, rap, and app, the home and mouse button as well. You can change your control model with the mouse button. Then comes to the plug. The plug cord is about one meter long, I suppose. It comes with different models based on different countries. This is HD cable, which will be connected to your TV. The wire connector looks nice. Here is the menu, follow the instructions and you will connect it easily. Then we take a look at the box. The logo Chomfy stays at the same place, the left bottom of the device top. It is easy to find. The MX2 is lighter and thinner than MX4. In the back of the box, there are the HD slot, USB port, power slot, and the network interface. SPDF Port. On one side of the box, we have got a SD card slot. It supports up to 42 gigabyte and another USB port. First, we should press the button at the bottom right of the box to switch on. Then we can see the LED light on the box goes into blue from red. Now let's take a look at the UI of Chomfy. The resolution is OK and the icons are quite clear to our eyes. Although we do not have real 4K TV by now, I would say I like the UI very much as it is easy to navigate. At the top of the TV, we can see how the weather is like. Not that hot today. The three toggles, the first one home, then more, the last one apps. As we can see. Then let's go through the next one. Here we can enter our favorite apps and view our holiday photos with our families. Then we will take a look at the most exciting parts all the internet things we use most like Google, Kodi, Netflix, Play Store and Skype and all available here. And absolutely we can move them to our favorites so that we can enter in fresh. Then we will have a brief show of how does the world famous plugin Kodi works. 
the upgraded XBMC, a journey begins. And I promise that there will be no end to the fun with your TV now. Chomvi offers preloaded Kodi, so just plug and play, save our time. Learn to watch YouTube videos, yams, PM, almost everything coming into your mind. No problem, our interest will be fulfilled. But a pity that we can not play anything here for copyright issues. A music fan can have access to a vast amount of music pre-installed add-ons. And we can get more. Pick one and you will be thrilled, and even better if your house is equipped with a hi-fi stereo. But I'm not sure if all the music will be free. So please try yourself. I selected one from my local storage and have a play. And if you are keen on watching some movies and TV shows on weekends, this box could not be a better choice. You can get it for only $45. With this menu, where you can choose different titles, actors, and genres. We can accurately locate the specific TV shows and movies we like. We already have some pre-installed apps, as we can see here. When the TV turns, and we can enjoy all the movies, TV shows, and music, as long as the app supports. I know many people prefer Netflix for video streaming, so we will see how powerful Chunfi can be with Netflix. The buffering takes some time as China's Netflix speed sucks. Seeing this without buyers, then we comes to the front page. The TV looks pretty like ours. Then we should enter the email address. Here we should be patient as we are typing with the remote. And I suggest that Chomfi can offer extra keyboard for easy navigation. But we can simply buy one. We like that this box asks for $45 only. Here we can take a view of some nice pictures. XBMC, the same things like Cody. We simply follow the menu and find our local pictures easily. Without tiny lag, going from one picture to another. And I have to say, I like the watch very much. Watching the hardy photos with your kids will be quite an enjoyment. And we can see the picture quality of the landscape is superb. And even better if you have a 4K TV. Also, we can serve the internet with this box. You can download Chrome or some other browsers. You can do it in the same way as you did in your PC for web searching. We have a quick show of entering tinydia.com and we can enter YouTube, Google or any other sites. Just keep in mind that our box has make your TV a STPC. The file browser will help us locate our file in the box or local storage quickly. With a Google account, we will be able to use Google Market. Some viewers may ask, can I have a shortcut to my favorites and apps I use most? Here I have already made Google and File Manager my favorites. Now we find that we can add all the apps to our favorites. And we can add Netflix, so that next time we can go directly into our favorites without bothering about where we can find our apps. The task here, which can help shut down the unused apps. 
and then 24.35 percent. Now it's a decent number. Here we will have a look at the settings. Some product settings our users must know. A Wi-Fi and Ethernet are on now because we have not installed VPN. So we were not able to enter Google in the previous web browsing section. Now, as we are more concerned about the display, here we can adjust the brightness and contrast, etc. And you can do it with the TV setting as well. We should pay more attention to the HDMI model setting. Scurry down different models and you can select HD 4K if you have a 4K TV. And we must change the language when we get the box. The default language is English when you get it. We can find almost every language exists in the world. Give a sum up to Chomfi. Another two settings we must mention is the box information and developers options. We can see the box running Android KitKat 4.4.2 and firm version. The developer can play with this box with many options here, like debugging and hardware rendering, etc. We will offer the source code SDK if you developers are truly interested in this box. The camera is kind of useless here for a TV box. It does not respond when we click on it. For copyright issues, we will just play a trailer with Cody. Jurassic Park An interesting movie and you can relish the adventure of these innocent people at home if you got a TV box The next step we are going to test is Mealcast, but it's weird that my phone cannot connect to my Wi-Fi today, so I cannot show you how this feature works, but we have already found that it is perfect for video streaming. Again, I have to say, this box does not have the best specifications and higher enough until to testing score, here is this 4K and H. 0.265 TV box. You will have full access to Netflix and Amazon Fire TV and all other media players. You and your families will have much fun with this powerful media streaming capacity. Thanks for watching. 